top 10 places to visit in Peru. The mysterious settlement of Machu Picchu has been featured on numerous tourist postcards, making Peru one of South America's most well-liked travel locations. Peru has much more to offer than decaying ruins, although the nation is well known for the Inca Trail and its old archaeological site. Spend as much time as you like exploring these Peruvian delights, which range from pre-Columbian settlements to the contemporary and historic communities of the Southern Peru Tourist Corridor. Number 10. Paracas National Reserve Paracas National Reserve is located along Peru's southern coastline, about 250 kilometres south of Lima, and is renowned for its dramatic landscapes, an abundance of archaeological sites, gorgeous beaches and wildlife. Its boundaries include marine and coastal desert environments, as well as a few dry, rocky islands. Small coves and beaches contain shallow warm waters ideal for swimming, while the ferocious waves pound its jagged crumbling cliffs and abandoned isles. While sailing and windsurfing are popular activities, its protected beaches are also beautiful for relaxing on. Number 9. Trujillo Trujillo, which is located eight hours north of Lima in a lush valley, is well known for its picturesque colonial centre, which is home to colourful Spanish palaces, charming churches and hospitable locals. This relatively big city was established in the 1500s near the abandoned Chan Chan ruins, one of the largest pre-Incan empires of ancient Peru, not far from the Pacific coast. This Chimol Mud City is the biggest adobe city in the Americas and contains impressive once-walled ruins, some religious buildings, burial grounds and royal residences. Trujillo's past is interesting for other reasons as well though. Visit the National University of Trujillo, one of South America's biggest institutions of its kind, which houses the world's largest mosaic. Number 8. Huacachina Huacachina in southwest Peru is a well-liked tourist destination because of its unique location surrounded by dunes. It is located just outside the city of Ica. The tiny community appears as a mirage as it emerges from the desert. It is centred on a remote oasis with gently swaying palm trees and nothing but sand for as far as the eye can see. Sandboarding, quad biking and dune buggy rides are all common outdoor pastimes in Huacachina thanks to the area's sandy terrain. For the breathtaking views, including especially memorable sunsets, it's also a must to scramble to the top of the sifting dunes. Number 7. Iquitos the majority of the northern Peruvian Amazon is located in the Loreto area, which includes Iquitos as its capital. It's interesting to note that Iquitos, a town that was first established by a tribe of hunter-gatherers, is now the biggest city on earth without access to a road. Iquitos requires travel by water or airplane, but the benefits are well worth the efforts. Despite its remote position, the town has a mix of traditional and contemporary architecture. Wooden huts perched on stilts alongside the river stand in stark contrast to the central plaza's old world buildings. Visitors can peruse the Belen floating market for anything from bananas to crocodile meat, providing an unforgettable escape in the Amazonian jungle that feels genuine. Number six, Nazca Desert. The intriguing Nazca lines that crisscross the Palpa and Nazca valleys have drawn attention to this area of Peru's otherwise boring desert. The Nazca people are thought to have carved these enormous inscriptions of lines, animals and other geometric patterns into the sandy terrain as a component of the thousand-year-old holy route. The Nazca Desert's constant, windless, dry climate has helped to maintain the lines visible up to this point. A flight over the Nazca Lines is the finest way to experience the scale of these geometric lines and shapes. 
There is an observation tower along the Pan American Highway where you can view three of the major figures if you're wary of flying or you just prefer to see them up close. Number 5. Colca Canyon Colca Canyon, one of Peru's most well-liked tourist destinations, is situated in the mountainous Southern Sierra area. The second deepest canyon in the world, measuring over 70 kilometres, offers breathtaking scenery as well as intriguing information about Andean culture and nature. Although the canyon's size and scope are staggering, the most remarkable aspect of Colca is the variety of its various landscapes, which range from the arid steppe and stepped terraces to steep-sided cliffs and rearing mountain summits. Stunning vistas of Andean condors soaring above the 3,140 metre deep canyon are available wherever you go. The canyon is dotted with archaeological sites and ruins and the locals still follow their ancestral customs in their tiny communities and cities. Number 4. Arequipa Arequipa, which is 2,380 metres above sea level, is the second largest metropolis in Peru. It is also known as the White City because it is surrounded by volcanoes including the El Misti and because the Silla, a white volcanic rock, was used to construct its structures. Arequipa lacks any notable Incan heritage, at least not in the shape of prehistoric settlements, in contrast to many of Peru's other cities. The Mami Juanita, also known as the Lady of Ampato, is its most well-known Inca site. It is the frozen corpse of a young teenage Incan girl who was sacrificed to the gods in the 1400s and it is remarkably well preserved. She is now housed in the Andean Sanctuaries Museum in the Catholic University of Santa Maria. There are numerous examples of Spanish colonial buildings in the city's core. The Santa Catalina Convent, one of the most important of these, is frequently referred to as a city within a city because of its charming streets, vibrant buildings and flowers. Beautiful bridges like the Puente Bolognese provide not only scenic views but also historical worth. Number 3. Cusco the vibrant Cusco, which is in the southern Sierras, was formerly the Incan Empire's headquarters. It is currently known as the America's Center of Archaeology. It is one of the most popular tourist destinations in Peru, and for good reason. It provides quick entry to Machu Picchu and the breathtaking Sacred Valley of the Incas. The main plaza, Plaza de Amas, which is surrounded by eateries, cafes and churches, was constructed by the Spanish on the foundations of ancient Incan temples and palaces. Nearby is the vibrant San Pedro market, where sellers offer fresh food and drink, in addition to Quechua handicrafts like alpaca textiles, painted pottery, ceramics and Peruvian figurines. The significant Inca site known as Saxawaman, a vast walled complex made of sizeable limestone boulders, is located just outside the city's boundaries. Due to its precise alignment with the yearly solstices and resilience to earthquakes, the location is a marvel of ancient architecture. The Quechua Cultural Centre in the Andes, the city is bursting with culture and its mountains are carved with hiking trails and thermal springs. It feels timeless to stroll through the city streets, which feature colonial architecture, artisan markets, museums, luxury hotels and art galleries. Number 2. Lima Lima, the capital and biggest city of Peru, is a massive metropolis home to nearly 9 million people. The city, which Francisco Pizarro, a Spanish conquistador, established in 1535, has a rich history, outstanding cuisine and a vibrant cultural scene. Modern hotels contrast with historic and colonial buildings and clean slums coexist with wild parties and bars. 
a true treat for history buffs, Lima, which the Spanish ruled for three centuries, is home to fascinating Spanish colonial churches, cloisters and monasteries. Due to its nearest to the ocean, Lima is a fantastic culinary destination for seafood lovers. With visits to some of the city's most authentic markets and restaurants, a food tour of Lima is a wonderful way to sample the city's authentic Peruvian delights like ceviche. You're in for something unique in Lima, whether you're strolling through the city's historic Centro district with its craft markets, or exploring the more tourist-friendly green suburb of Miraflores, which is brimming with bars and antique stores. Number one, Machu Picchu. No matter why you are traveling to Peru, Machu Picchu is everyone's favorite South American nation. This abandoned old Incan city is hidden 2,430 meters up in the Andes and appears to be forever shrouded in fog. It is so well hidden that it went for centuries without being found, garnering it the moniker, the lost city of the Incas. Eventually, an adventurer found the location, but even then, it was only by chance. It has grown to be one of the world's most sought-after destination on bucket lists in the years since its discovery. This implies that there will be crowds, so make sure to schedule your journey well in advance. A few of the most well-liked routes to this deteriorating Incan sites are the Salcante or Inca trails. There is a simpler path by train for those who would rather not climb by foot. You have a lot to do when you get there, regardless of how you get there. Investigate well-maintained structures such as homes, churches, fountains and baths, as well as agricultural terraces and signs of an irrigation system. Additionally, you can take in the surroundings of the Sun Gate, which serves as the renowned Inca Trail's entrance to Machu Picchu, and climb Huayna Picchu or Machu Picchu Mountain for an up-close view of the gorgeous valleys.